Paisley, this is out of hand. You ordered so many clothes. Oh my goodness. Welcome back to my channel. So today is going to be a Lululemon haul. This one's kind of overdue, just not that because I haven't done one in a while, just because I ordered a ton of stuff and it's just been sitting in my room waiting to have the time to just sit down and film it because it's so much stuff and I know it's going to take a while and I don't want to rush through it, but I'm going to try to be not too talkative, but I don't know, just my normal thing. I'm going to have all my stats down below everything linked down below what the sizes I got and I'm going to put it on the screen as I'm wearing this stuff as well. Um, what I like to do is just talk about each item and then you'll see it on me in the next clip talking about the item on me as well. And if you don't know, this is Paisley and she just kind of watches me. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm just going to start right off with what I'm wearing. So I'm wearing the Align Tank. This is actually what I wore to Pilates this morning and I'm still shaking. So if I seem shaky, that's why. And yeah, this is the Align Tank in that cafe color. I don't even want to pronounce the name because I actually got this color in the Energy Longline bra a while ago and someone told me how to pronounce the name of the color and I already forgot it. And anyways, it is just like this really pretty neutral color. I'm into the nude vibes. It like matches my nails actually. And it looks really good with the tan. So really good for the summer. And I get a size six in the Align Tank, which is my normal sports bra, sports bra size. And otherwise in tops, I usually get a size four, but bras, I would stick with a size six. And yeah, I'm kind of bummed because I'm someone who doesn't wait for things to go on sale. So I never want to risk waiting to see if it goes on sale. And then once it goes on sale, I'm missing when it sells out into the, in the most popular sizes. So apparently when I bought this, it went on sale like the next day and I probably could have called to get a price check on it, but I just never did because I didn't remember until literally just now when I'm making this video. So yeah, I'm going to show you. I'm just wearing it with black aligns. Okay, so here is the top with just black aligns. Nice neutral vibes right here. But then the next item I'm going to talk about, we're just going to get right into it. It's this Servit jacket. So this actually was not on my radar at all. And it wasn't until I went shopping yesterday and it was at Lulu. And I was like, you know, I've heard good things about this jacket. Let me try it. And I really, really like it because it's so light, but it just like provides enough, you know, coverage for you during this time of year. And it just fits so well. And like the cuffs are so stretchy and I don't know, just it fits so well. And it's such a flattering fit so yeah i just thought this was like a must but as soon as i put it on and i just think you know black's like a staple outfit so and i don't really have a jacket that like hits at this length that's this kind of style and whatnot so yeah i actually wore this to Pilates today because it's 55 degrees here in new jersey so it's not the nicest out and yeah it just is right the perfect amount of warm so I would definitely stick with a size four in this jacket. I wouldn't size up to a six. Like I feel like the sleeves come right to the ends here and it fits really well. And this isn't a jacket that you would wear like a lot of layers under. So I wouldn't see a reason to like size up for it or anything. I would just stick with your true size here. Okay, so next I wanna stick with the nude vibes and talk about the color trench. So I went from not having a single pair of trench to all of a sudden ordering a ton of trench. I don't know why, I just was like, you know, I don't know what I want. I'm just gonna try to, and I kinda wanted like a cute set, so I just got it all. And I just wanted to compare it. It's very, very similar to the cafe color. Um, probably a little bit more of a like, I don't know, like a darker tone. Where in the lighting, Matt first thought this was like a green color, the trench, um, which I guess I can see if it's really dark, but when he said, is that green? I literally looked at him with like 10 heads like, are you kidding me? This is not green. <laughs> Anyways, so that's the kind of nude it is, just to compare it here. So yeah, I got it obviously here in the Kate's Tee, size four in that. And then I got it in the perfectly oversized crew, with crop crew, which is um, a size four. And then I got it in this LA front crop tank here, it's inside out. This is a size four as well. And then I got it in the Soft Ambitions shorts in a size six, which I did got this last year in a gray. And I tried a four and a six. I remember last year and I ended up keeping the six because it is more of a relaxed fit. So I didn't really want it to be like too tight or anything. So yeah, I'm gonna try all that on for you. 
but you know i just really like the neutral vibes and this is something i'm definitely gonna need your opinion on because when i put on the outfit matt didn't like it which i was surprising because he's someone that's into neutral so i thought he would vibe it but he thought it was like a prisoner vibe so very interested to hear your thoughts that's why all the tags are on because one i haven't tried on a lot of stuff yet because i haven't had the time and two i need your opinions all right, so before I tried on the trench with the other trench I got, I just wanted to show you it with this cafe aligned tank, just so you could see the color difference here. If you do have this tank and we're thinking about this outfit, it's not bad, but it's definitely like off enough where I think I would just prefer all one color. Um, so yeah, you can see here, these are the size six. So they're definitely like really loose around my waist and stuff, um, but they look fine on the back. I remember last year when I sized down to a four, I just like the seam in the middle just felt like it was pulling a lot like, you know, around there where I just felt like it was kind of too tight and I just, you know, it's more of a lounge short anyway. So I just kind of wanted it to just be a size six. So yeah, so it looks like here. So now I'm just gonna try on the other tops with these shorts. All right, so here it is paired with the LA cutout tank. And I think it's so cool. And I feel like it's something people probably wouldn't think to pair together, but I think it works so well. and. I just really like this tank, how open it is back here, and the cut is really pretty. I'm actually wearing it with a Skims bralette, so it works really well where like the shafts don't really show. So I thought that was really cute, and I just really like the neutral vibes here. So I thought this was really cool paired together. Um, but it's funny because like even though this looks cute together, when I put on the crew, I feel like or the other tee, Matt didn't like those paired together. Like he thought that was too much trench, but for some reason this one's not too much trench. Um, maybe just cause it's like enough of a cutout where it just works, but I thought this was cool. And sorry, I don't have any padding on and it's really cold in here, so I'm not sure if you can tell, but <laughs> um, yeah, this, I just thought was such a cool outfit. All right, so I don't know. I really like this outfit. I don't know why, there is people out there that thought this was too much trench, but I think it looks so cute. And it's obviously so comfy if you know this material. Um, so this, I actually really don't like how they called it the perfectly oversized crop crew, because if you buy this, you might think that it feels like the perfectly oversized crew, which it doesn't. It feels like the soft ambition material. It also feels like that sweatshirt that was popular, I forget what it was called, but it was that cropped hoodie that had that cut out here that was popular I think it was in the fall and I remember I got it but it stained really easily so I didn't end up keeping it and that's the only thing I'm nervous of with this if, if it stains if it's able to come out well so that's my only hesitation otherwise I love this outfit because it's so unbelievably comfy like I don't even know how to describe the material it's almost like a really slick almost like scuba material I don't know but like it's just very warm and comfy um and yeah i just love this color together and i just feel just such like so trendy you know <laughs> and yeah so i just don't know what to do um if you guys have this or have had this for a while let me know if you think it stains easily because that's what i just feel like it might and obviously it's pricey so i would just be nervous keeping it um I think you can't even crop this even more if you wanted to like put it underneath your sports bra and just be even more cropped here. I think that would be really cute as well. Also, I got this white fanny pack because I have my black fanny pack blue, which I wear like every single day. So I was like, let me try white, but I don't think I'm really vibing the white as much as I did the black. Um, obviously, it could definitely get dirty more, but I don't know, it looks really cute with this outfit. But I think I probably would always just end up grabbing black, um, but I don't know. I just thought this was something cute to try. All right, last trench outfit is with the Kate's tee size four, which I think fits perfectly. So you can either wear like tucked into the shorts or you can like twist it up and like tie it and wear it as like a cute cropped tee. And yeah, I don't know. I just think this color just is so cute. So I'm really curious to what you guys are gonna say. If you think this is just way too much trench, or it just totally works and i don't know like which to keep because as you can see i got so much trench but i don't know like which i would get the most use out of um so yeah i'm torn but and i do have the kate's tee in white black and gray which are obviously staples um but i feel like trench can go with a lot of different stuff too so here we are with just a lot of clothes so i really like hearing what you guys have to think okay so next we're 
have new lines here. It's the red Merlot Aligns. And yeah, this is just a really, really pretty color. I used to have dark purple leggings. I don't think it was the Casis, I think, or Cassis. I think it was ones that came a long time ago. I ended up selling them, I don't know why. So I actually don't really have this kind of color Merlot Aligns, but let me just compare it to some other similar colors just so you can see now that I think of it. All right, so I do have the Cassis or Cases, however you pronounce it, shorts, Align shorts. So this is the Red Merlot. So as you can see, they're pretty different. Red Merlot is definitely more of a red and the Cases is definitely more of like a purple, I would say. So they are definitely different. And then this is Brown Earth and Ancient Copper, just so you could see all those tones together. So definitely very much red vibes in that Merlot. So yeah, I just got this in size four, which is my normal Align size. And then I'm gonna pair it with a few different tops here. So I'm just gonna show you the tops and then I'll try them on after. So first, let's just start and continue with the Align tank here. So I just got the Align tank in Spiced Kai and I'm waiting for them to come out with the Align 25 inch in Spiced Kai, but they haven't done it. They came out with it in a ton of other stuff. I'm waiting for just the regular lines in Spiced Kai. And then I got two pink puff items, which I'm not sure which one I'll keep it or if I'll keep both, but I was really digging the pink puff when I was looking online. So I got the Energy Bra Long Line in size six and the Ebb to Street Crop Tank in size four. I size down in the Ebb to Street Crop Tank, even though it's like a sports bra, just because they are super stretchy. So I prefer a size four in these ones. Um, and then lastly, I'm gonna pair with a simple free to be wild bra in size six. This is a blue linen color, which came out a little while ago, but I feel like this sports bra came out a little bit after the color came out. And I got it in the Align Tank and I really like the blue linen color. So I had to get it in the bra. Okay, right, so here's the Spice Kai Align Tank, and it's actually my first time trying it on, and I didn't even think to pair with these leggings when I was buying the outfit, but I think it looks so good together, and I don't even know if I'm like stressed about getting the Spice Kai Color Align leggings, I think this works really well, and yeah, this color's just so pretty, and it's just like, I don't know, I don't know why they didn't come out with, it with Aligns yet, but I really like this color and I think it'll match a lot of stuff like unexpectedly. It's like a, I don't know, it could really work well with different colors, I feel like. So I feel like it is a color that would look good on like a lot of skin tones. Like I feel like you might think like it might blend in with yours, but I don't know if it would. I think it would look pretty good. So yeah, I just really like this color. Okay, so here is the Pink Puff Energy Longline Bra and it's just, I don't even know. Now I feel like I like the pink puff even better with the Merlot or with the red Merlot lines. Like they both look so good. It's such a good tonal match. Um, and yeah, I don't know. I really like the long line energy bras better than the regular energy. I just feel like it's a little bit more flattering as like where it hits, I feel like. And I just like how it can work as like a crop top too rather than just a sports bra, but it's still so supportive. Um, if I go for a run or if it's that time of month and my, I'm like feeling pretty swollen, like I always grab these kind of sports bras. They just feel really supported in it. Um, and yet it's still like really cute and flattering, even though it's very supported, it's not like too much coverage or something. So yeah, I really like the way this looks. And here is what the back looks like. So nice strappy back still. And yeah, I like this pink puff color. Alright, so now here we have the Pink Puff Up to Street Crop Tank. Again, it's such a cute color pairing. Uh, a size 4 in this. Um, I just feel like a size 6, it just is like a little bit too loose around here. And a size 4 fits perfectly. Um, the only thing is if you're weary about like the sides hanging out here, uh, I feel like I don't get it too much. Um, but, you know, if you're like just self-conscious about that, then maybe size up to a six, but I feel pretty good in a size four. I feel like covered and everything. Um, the only thing about these ones is like the cup pads can kind of come like centered a little bit. So you have to like make sure to like pull them out to make them like look nicer. That's the only thing is the pads are a little bit awkward in this or you can even take them out if you wanted to. But yeah, I really like these tanks because it's like a nice high neck, but it's not choking you at all. And it's so stretchy and comfortable and it comes at like the perfect length too. It's nice and flattering and it has a nice back too, I like the racer back vibes. So yeah, I really like these tanks. I remember last year they were like really hard to get. This year they seem to be coming out in more colors, which I really like. So, so far I have it in black and blue linen, I believe. So yeah, these are just really cute tanks. 
Um, they can be like, you know, just like out to run errands or to work out in. And yeah, and also I think that the pink mist color, people were complaining about it being like kind of see-through, but I don't think I really get that with this color. I think this color, let's see. Yeah, this color doesn't really look see-through like at all to me, uh, like the pink mist was. So I think this would be a better color to get if you were like not sure about that. All right, let's stick with the Red Merlot vibes here. So I literally got a matching set. I got the like a cloud bra in Red Merlot in size six, which I had this bra in multiple colors and I kind of don't know why I didn't get it in the Cassis color. Um, I should have gotten it in that color, but now it's all sold out. So I did the Red Merlot, which is fine because I feel like I really like this outfit here with the Align shorts. If you don't know, the Align six inch shorts are my favorite shorts. I have them in so many colors. This is a size four and it just fits perfectly. It's a perfect length. Um, I wouldn't change anything about it. So this, I just thought would be a really cute set. All right, so here is the red Merlot set, a size four in the bottoms and red, a size six in the top. So yeah, so comfortable. This is my first time trying the set. I will say the only thing about the like a cloud bra um, are this, I don't like the front as much as I like the back just because I do spill out the sides on the front. I feel like there could be a little bit more coverage on the sides, but I kind of put up with it because it's such a soft material and I just love the straps and how that looks, like especially from the back. I like how simple it looks back there and just like, I don't know, it just looks so nice. So that's the only thing is, again, like the sides of the bra. Um, I feel like I used to not get as much, but I did gain a little bit more weight like in my upper back area. And so I'm like around here. So I was just where my camera just overheated, but I think it got all that basically I was saying just, I love the bra. The only thing I'd be cautious of is the sides, if that's something that bothers you. Um, it's definitely not like supportive, but it's just like a really nice simple bra and they come out with really cute colors. So yeah, and I really like this set together. So yeah, that is the Red Merlot set. Sticking with the cute set, we got another pair of line shorts. Still haven't tried these ones on either and I'm really excited too. It's the chambray color. Again, a line short six inch size four. Um, chambray, the leggings and the aligns came out a really long time ago. So I got those probably over a year ago at this point. And I like them, but I don't wear them that much because the color is very light and gives me a lot of camel toe. So I'm curious how these shorts are gonna feel on me. If I'm gonna feel like too exposed, I don't know. But ugh, it's gonna be such a cute pairing with this energy long line bra, size six, in the we are space nimbus color battleship you know that vibe with the um i want to say this is chambray even the lining no it's blue linen okay so but i feel like it's really similar like you probably wouldn't notice that it's that different you know so anyways i thought that'd be really cute okay so here we have the same shorts but in chambray and now the energy long line top again in the space nimbus color so yeah i really like this outfit like combined but I'm just not sure how I feel about the chambray shorts I feel the same way I feel about them in the leggings like my camel toe I feel like just gets so bad in them and it definitely shows cellulite really easily and like if you're pale I feel like it really washes you out even more so I'm just not sure how I feel about the chambray like with that being said I probably won't end up keeping the shorts which is confusing because I love the line shorts but I don't know I could just be crazy and like, I love this combo so I'm not really sure like I think it goes so well but yeah let me know what you guys think I don't know I feel like chambray was talked up a lot and that's why it's just like in my head that like people love chambray but I just don't know if I like it as much as other colors you know but yeah otherwise this combo is so cute and I really do love the back of the sports bra um, and I don't know, I wonder if it would be cute or just like too much if I paired it with the Space Nimbus Aligns because I have those in the Align shorts and the leggings. So that could be a vibe. <laughs> and sticking with the set vibe, we got the Heather Tidewater Teal. So I got this in the Align 25 inch first and I actually really like it. Sometimes these Heathered fit me differently. Like I think it was the like heathered lunar moon rock color or something that those aligns didn't really fit me that well but this color fits me decently well like i would say probably not as 
great as regular lines, but still um, like good enough. They're so soft. So I don't know. I feel like, you know, this fit might look a little different on different people, but I like the way it fits on me. And then I didn't think this set would vibe together, but when I put it on, I was feeling it and Matt actually liked it. And if you know Matt, he's hard to please. So um, yeah, I really liked this set together. All right, so here we are in this full set. And I don't know, I just really like the way this set works together. Obviously I love the line leggings and the line tank. So if I can wear it together, like that's just like the ultimate comfort. And I just feel like I'm ready to do like a Pilates class, you know, in this set. I actually did an upper body workout in it. I didn't do Pilates, but I felt really good, very comfortable and cute. So I don't know, I liked this set. Might not be everyone's favorite, like being full on Heather tied water teal, but I vibe with it. <laughs> But this is also what I was saying, like it does fit a little bit different than regular lines, I feel like, because when I pull it down, like I feel like it comes below my, like it sits its best right below my belly button, which other lines I feel like sits at least on it. So I don't know what it is about this sex. It's not like it's not stretchy. It's very stretchy and very soft, but I think the fit looks, is just like a little different than normal lines, but that's just something to keep in mind. But I like the way it fits on me and I just think these lines and like heatheredness is just like really flattering um, on the boots as well. So yeah. All right, next outfit is the high rise stretch shorts. It's like, I think three and a half inch in seam. And I wasn't gonna get these because I thought they were too similar to in the fly, which I've had in the fly, but I did get it in a size four cause that's what I used to be, but I grew. So I grew out of them, so I sold them and I just never bothered to try a size six. And these are definitely a very similar fit, but I think I would like these better than the In The Fly because they are just so stretchy. And the waistband is interesting because like it's soft right here. And I just like, I don't know, so stretchy. And I would say the material feels pretty similar to In The Fly. I haven't tried those in years, so I'm not too sure, but it seems pretty similar. And I'm pretty sure the way that the um, bottom of the shorts falls kind of different here with like how that curves in like that and this is actually a high-rise short if you know Lulu doesn't their high-rise like running shorts aren't really that high-rise but these ones are definitely high-rise and sometimes when they're high-rise that means your butt hangs out but on these your butt does not hang out and it doesn't like ride up or it ever will hang, hang out so these ones are amazing I literally wore them like three days in a row with different color line tanks because it just looks really good within a line tank. So that's what I'm pairing it with. I got the green fur in a line tank right here. It's such a pretty green. And yeah, it just looks so good and also looks good with just like a black line tank for an all black fit and just such a staple short to just like run every single errand in. All right, we're finally at the last line tank of this haul. Um, and yeah, I don't know, I think this color is just like really classy. There's like something about it. I just think it looks really good. And these shorts are just amazing. As you can see why I wore this like every day because I have a ton of aligned tanks and they just fit perfectly with these shorts. Like it meets at the right spot and it just is like the perfect outfit. It's so comfortable and just like perfect for summer. So yeah, the waistband is so stretchy. Again, these are size six and I would stick with that. I wear six in all shorts pretty much except for align shorts uh, i wear those the same size as my aligns uh, these don't have a liner in them and as you can see they're just like plant like it's like a perfect length where it's not an awfully long length and it's not short either like i can bend down and i'm fine and it doesn't like move when you walk it just stays right it's right at my belly button so it's nice and high waisted and there's pockets here and yeah i just think these are just perfect shorts so if you haven't checked these out, I would start, really recommend them. If you need like a short like this, this is the perfect one to get. I actually told Matt's mom about these shorts and she got them and she loves them too. So yeah, it works for anyone, no matter what age. <laughs> okay, so now I have a ton of shirts left that I'm going to pair everything with just my black six inch align shorts. Okay, so we got this free to be wild bra in the golden apricot color apricot <laughs> such a pretty summer color and i'm sure it looks so good with the tan as you can see i haven't even tried it on yet but i'm definitely going to keep this i love this color and then sticking with the orange vibe so i got a lot of different all yours tees so just bear with me here <laughs> i got this 
orange one. What even is this wash? I'm sorry, I don't even remember the name of this wash, but it's just like that cloud wash. And I really liked this orange color and then it sold out, but then it came back in stock. And I was like, you know, I gotta get it. And this is a size six. So I got this one. And then I also got this one at the same time. This is the ripened raspberry color and this is a size four. So I always struggle in the all years to see if I wanna like size up a little bit and make it like really oversized or size down or get my normal size. So this one, I got two different sizes and I'm still not sure what to do. But also it's really hard for me to like just try it on because it's these washes for some reason smell so bad. It's like such bad chemicals. And I just need to wash it. Whatever one I'm keeping, I need to wash right away before I even wear it because I can't stand the smell of this right now. But um, they're just such cool washes. I think on me, I ended up liking the ripened raspberry, but I just want to show you both. And then obviously I got more washes because I just, they came out with such cool stuff. So I got the um, Earth Day wash in a size six. And I'm very happy with the size six. I already wore this so comfy. I already Instagrammed in it because I just wore it all day and it was just so cute. And I'm happy with the size six in this one, I think. I don't know, for some reason is I feel like different in each color, like it looks different and different sizes. So I don't know. And then even this one I got in two sizes. I got a two and a four. So I, this is my first time trying a size two and I think I just, um, like it makes like a little bit tighter on the sleeves to the fact where like it's not as much a relaxed fit. So I think I don't really would want the two. I think I would either stick with a four or size up to a six in the all yours tees, but I'm going to try and both to show you. Um, and this swatch is just really cool. I thought if you just want to like, you know, all black kind of vibes there. All right. And now we're almost done. So to stick with the shorts again, I got the Kate's tee. So this is a Kate's tee in size four in the crisp and green color. I feel like everyone was raving about this color. So I got the all yours tee in it. And honestly, I don't think it's that special. So I probably will return this, but we'll see once I try it on how I'm feeling again. Cause I've only tried it on once like a week ago and we'll see how I feel now. <laughs> And then last but not least, I've never tried this top. It's the Swiftly Tech Racerback Tank in the race length. So I do have a lot of Swiftly's short sleeves and a long sleeve, but I've never tried the tank one. And I have been trying to run more. So I was like, you know, now it's getting hotter, even though this weekend was 50 degrees. Um, but I was like, you know, and this was a really cool color. Let's see what color this is. All right, I was just going through my orders to find what color that is and i just realized something's missing in my order i got another pair of line shorts so i'm gonna have to search through my bags to see if like maybe i missed it so i might have another item but that is really funny that i ordered so much stuff that i literally forgot that that was in my order okay this was the wild mint color that's what it was such a cool color and i'm sure it would look so good in the tan okay that is so funny, I literally dumped out my bag cause I put like all the wrappers into one bag and this got stuffed to the bottom, which you know, you could see it kind of like blends in with like the wrappers and it's so tiny. So yeah, I got this like kaleidoscope color. It was called something like that. And honestly, I'm not the biggest fan of it, but when I showed Matt online, he was like, oh, that's really cool. And I'm like, is it? So I was like, let me just order it and see. And I'm not sure what I'll pair it with. I guess maybe I'll pair it with the blue linen top. So. Yeah, I'm gonna just pair it with that so then I won't even have to try it on with the Merlot outfit leggings, but that is really funny. So that's also kind of embarrassing. <laughs> okay, so I just took the tag off. This is my first time putting on the golden apricot and I just love it. It's such a pretty color. And this is just one of my top favorite sports dress from Lulu. However, I will say like, if you are someone that's bigger chested, this definitely won't work for you. I feel like I'm borderline where it works. Uh, like some days I'm a C, some days I'm a B, and I definitely on like my fuller days I can't wear this bra because then I'll spill out of it. But um, when I'm not as full, it works, you know, because then um, it's just such a flattering neckline. It's just so stretchy and breathable, and it has obviously a really cute strappy back over here, and it comes in just the cutest colors. All right, sorry, my camera keeps overheating because it knows how excited I am about all this little and stuff, but. As I was saying, it comes in the cutest colors and there's a really nice strappy back where I feel like it just is flattering on everyone. 
and it's not one of those strappy bags where it like digs into your back fat either it's just it's really nice and this is just a stretchy band too so yeah i just really like these bras anyways moving on to the all yours tea now so here's the cloud watch color this is how that orange compares to this orange and let's see now the size six so this is what it looks like and i'm 5 8 with the really long legs so this is where it comes to on me so yeah i don't know i actually i really like this and i don't know what to do i'm gonna need your help deciding on if i should keep one color over the other because i was also thinking like what if I want to crop one, like, because they have free hemming at Lulu and make it a cropped all year tee? Because I wear a lot of crop stuff. Um, so I don't know what to do. Because, like, obviously, once you crop it, like, you're stuck with that. And I don't know. And, like, I feel like a size six is too much fabric to wear cropped because then it's just like it's kind of like too bulky. I mean, you could definitely do it, but yeah, I guess it's not bad. You just have like a lot of like is the knot, you know, when like you crop a big shirt and the knot is just like awkwardly big. I feel like it looks a little awkward, but it definitely could work. So I don't know. Let me know what you guys think, like what color you're vibing the best after a try on the ripened raspberry color in a size four. All right, so here we are. I'm thinking in my head right now to keep the orange one, keep that oversized, and then maybe hem the ripened raspberry one. I don't know, it's just such a big decision and I suck at making that decision. Like I cropped a white align tank and I had that to make that more of a sports bra, which was a good decision because I could just buy a white, another white align tank, like regular size, and I have now two options, but that would be way too much to buy like this in a full size and also hem one. So I don't know. Let me know what you guys think on that decision there. Alright, so we're back with the size 6 here, and again, I'm very happy with the size 6 for an oversized look. I think that's definitely the way to go. And yeah, so, I mean, at least on me, because I'm 5'8", like I said, and I'm pretty tall, so I feel like to be like true oversized with the biker shorts, not that this is biker, because it's 6 inch, but I don't know, I like this size, like shorts, but I don't know, I just think this works, and this is just a nice neutral vibe again, and I really like this brown color i just feel like it's just very cool you know i wear them with my analog easies and it just worked really well together and i just feel like really comfy in this outfit all right so i have the next one the black cloud wash one on and i want to show you how like sometimes i do like to tuck shirts under and like kind of roll them up and then tuck them back here underneath my sports bra but like i'm saying is that because it's an oversized look it's kind of too much fabric where it just kind of looks like really bulky right here. So it doesn't really work that way, which is just why I'm like conflicted as to what sizes to keep. But um, like it probably just looks best when you tie it in a front tie here. So let me just see what that is. So here is the front tie look. I just kind of tied it around itself. But as you can see, it's just like really sticking out here. So I don't know why I feel so awkward in that. But I don't know, let me know how you guys wear your, all your seat, I'm interested. I just feel like there's so many different ways I can wear it and I'm overwhelmed. <laughs> so hence why I got like five different colors and three different sizes. So yeah, I really like this color though because it's just a very neutral vibe and this is just the comfiest shirt ever. If you haven't tried the All Your C, clearly you need to try it. <laughs> so here is the size two now. So I just want to show you, um, obviously it's going to be shorter and I could feel that like, you know, it comes to like my shoulders right here. I definitely think like this collar is more fitted and I think because it's more fitted it actually looks a little bit awkward because the sleeves are still like kind of wide looking like they flare out up here so I think that is maybe a little bit of an awkward fit if it's just like more fitted here but the sleeves are kind of flared out still so that's why I feel like I like sticking with the size 4 or keeping it size 6 even so yeah I don't know I don't think that would be that noticeable to like anyone else being it's just like in my mind, I feel like they're kind of more flared out at the side here. So I don't know. Also, let me know if you guys like kind of stick with your true size, size up or size down all your ST. What do you guys do? Okay, so now this is the Kate's T size four in the Crispin Green color. And I am wanting to probably take back my words because I do think this is a really cute color now that I have it on with black aligned shorts. I think maybe I just wasn't wearing the right matching like bottoms before. But now I think this just is a really cute set for the summer. So yeah, I'll probably keep the Kate's tea in crisp and green. 
Um, and yeah, it just seems like really good with the tan. And the Kate's tea, I know sizing, people are not sure what to do. I will say with the Kate's tea, the one thing is like for it trying to be like an oversized crop tea, the sleeves are definitely fitted. So definitely don't size down in it. Like you can probably get away with sizing up in it. I'm fine sticking with the size four, um, but that's a thing. And like, if you are working out in them, like this, the sleeves here are fitted. So you will probably show sweat underneath your arms. And yeah, but I really like the way it fits and it is something where you can tie up and it won't be a big bulky tie like the all yours tee. Um, and it would look really cute like this and I think it would look really nice for the summer. So I actually do really like this pair together. I will say the only thing about them is um, they can get wrinkled really easily I feel like. So just make sure when you're like storing them away that you don't like just crumble it up because it will get wrinkled. Um, so yeah, just something to keep in mind. Okay, so this is my first time trying this kind of tank on and I really, really like it. I think it's so flattering. I'm so happy that they like evolved and made race length shirts because I really just like would never buy the shirts because they were always literally not exaggerating like down here, like so long. And I ended up having them myself to get them this length because it just made no sense. Um, and I'm so happy they have these lengths now because it just makes a lot more sense just come to your hips and it's just is such a flattering look and a lot more comfortable and i think the neckline on this is perfect it just like hits really well and i love the um like logo on here and just like this detail on it is just so nice and flattering and not to mention this color is obviously so pretty and then it does have that racer bait back over there obviously i'm wearing it with um the free to be wild bra so it shows but if you wanted to wear a racer back bra with it then your straps wouldn't show. And this is a shirt where you could probably can also like tie it up if you wanted it to be um, like even more cropped. But I feel like if I were wearing this, I would just like wear it regular, like to literally go running in. And yeah, I think this is like really cute for the summer and would look good in all black as well. Okay, so as expected, um, I think that these shorts itself are so comfortable. Like, you know how sometimes the pattern kinds are just a lot more stretchier? I feel that, like I feel like these are a lot comfier, but I just really don't like the pattern. Like I feel like I almost hate it, but I know that's dramatic to say, but yeah, it just like doesn't work for me. And I feel like when I don't have a spray tan and I'm pale, like I'll never want to grab these shorts. Um, and I already like the blue linen top. Like I already wore this to work out in and I really like the color of this top, but even pairing it with the shorts, I'm like, do I like this top? Because I just don't like the shorts, but I don't know. I'm sorry if you like the shorts, but I don't know what this color is. Um, I'm just, I don't feel like it works for me. So kind of sad to leave the haul on this note, but obviously I have so much stuff. So I'm like happy when I don't like something and I can be like, I am comfortable returning that, but yeah. Just kidding, that wasn't the last item, so we can end on a high note. Um, I forgot, I was just editing this video and I forgot that I got these Align shorts recently that I haven't shown you guys like with these orders but, like by itself because I guess I missed this release and then someone DM'd me actually about these shorts and yeah, they're just such a pretty diamond dye color and the diamond dyes are just so soft and yeah, I don't know, I just really like the like dark purple undertones and I feel like it can like match some random sports bras like probably like Cassis if you have that one that's why I wish I got the Cassis like a cloud bra but I'm just wearing the black Kate's tee right now and yeah I just really like it I feel really comfortable in this pattern so if you miss this release I suggest you get this pattern or if you're thinking about it I think it's a really nice one and I'm surprised I see it's still in stock online like I'm Surprise, I feel like this is a diamond dye that would kind of go pretty fast because it's pretty and I feel like, you know, it's not like a color where you'd feel uncomfortable in. So, yeah, I just wanted to mention this one before I ended it. All right, so that is it for my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. This is a lot of stuff. I actually ordered more stuff last week that still hasn't come yet. So either I am going to do another haul depending on if I order more stuff tomorrow because tomorrow is Tuesday. If not, I'll just do it on my Instagram story and just show you the stuff I got there because I did get some cute stuff like the Align 6-inch shorts with pockets, which I'm really interested to try. 
um, and they're reversible shorts as well. So if you guys don't follow me on Instagram, I share literally everything I always buy on there because um, it's obviously a lot easier to just do it on there. So yeah, if you have any questions, just leave them down below where you can DM me. Other than that, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.